I've got some chairs to show you today. Now, I have reviewed all of the gaming chairs produced by Boolies on the channel in the past, but that was all individually. I've now got a chair from each of their Master, Elite and Ninja Pro series, all here to show you, all in the room at the same time. So here's a showcase of everything that Boolies offer for the gamers out there in 2024. Hi guys, I'm Matt and welcome to Kit Guru. So any regular viewers should be aware of Boolies by now. You'll no doubt have seen my face in many videos telling you to go and check out boolies.co.uk if you're after a new chair for your setup. So here's a video summarizing who they are and what their gaming chairs offer. The company itself started in London back in 2015, and since then they've gone international with operations in the US and Australia. All of their gaming chairs come backed by their standard warranty, which will cover materials and workmanship for two years for any faults arising from normal use. Then you can also opt for Boolies Warranty Plus for an additional cost if you choose to pick a chair up, which adds an extra year of protection and protection against any of the finishes peeling. Let's have a look at what's on offer then, starting at the top of the lineup. The Master Series is Boolies most expensive chair, starting at around £370 for the standard model and going up to £400 for the Max version when at full price. They do have sales on their website quite regularly. The Max and the non-Max are both pretty much the same chair, with the Max just being designed for larger and heavier users. Each size is available in three different finishes, Ultra Flex PU, water repellent fabric or luxurious Nappa leather. The PU and fabric options come in a variety of different colours, whereas the Nappa leather one is just Nappa leather. There's bound to be something there to suit everyone's taste. There's quite a lot to choose from, to be honest. The Master Series is the Boolies chair that will suit more than just a gaming setup, thanks to its more mature and serious design. It's got a big focus on comfort, thanks to its round edge cushion design and wide seat cushion. Lower back support is excellent. The fully adjustable lumbar support is one of the best implementations I've ever seen in any chair that I've reviewed. Dials on each side of that backrest allow you to literally dial in the perfect support for your back and it keeps you going through lengthy work or gaming sessions without any fatigue or backache. The adjustability doesn't stop there though. The armrests are 4D and they go up, down, in, out, forwards, backwards and they rotate. There's not a lot that they can't do. Alongside that, you've got all of the regular and usual chair adjustment features like chair height, tilt and recline. There's plenty to allow you to get comfortable. I've got one of each of the Ultraflex PU and fabric finishes in my office right now, each offering a different style to suit different preferences. The black Ultraflex PU and the grey water repellent fabric both look kind of stylish and sophisticated, but in slightly different ways. The five spoke base is made from aluminium and houses five extra large PU casters that are 60 mil in diameter. And then of course the class four gas lift. Cushioning on the master is the firmest you're gonna find out of the three gaming chairs from Boolies. It will suit anyone who wants a sturdy feel to their seat with lots of support and not too much of a sinking feeling when you sit down while still remaining soft enough to be comfortable all day long. Overall, the Master Series chairs are the bullish chair to go with if you want something big, curvaceous and versatile. It'll handle gaming and work with ease, and whether you're a big or a small person, you'll be able to get comfortable thanks to the wealth of adjustability options. Next up then is the Elite, the thinner, leaner and taller bullish chair that also sits somewhere in between your typical gaming and office chair designs. It still keeps comfort at the forefront of the features, which is a key part of Boolie's design principles. Just like the Master, the Elite is available in both a standard and a max version, catering to both smaller and larger users. Both of those variants are available in the same Ultraflex PU and water repellent fabric as the Master that I spoke about a moment ago, but there's no Nappa leather finish this time around. As for colors, you've got blue, black and white in the PU, and then two shades of different gray in the fabric. Back support is handled a little differently when you compare this chair to the Master, with the curved design to the ergonomic backrest mimicking the natural curvature of your spine and handling comfort and ergonomics. The Elite drops the adjustable lumbar support thanks to that backrest, but Boolies do include a removable cushion if you need a little more support, and they also throw in a neck pillow that attaches onto the headrest. Styling is a little different. It's a slimmer, more streamlined and taller design, as I mentioned a second ago, which features more of a, a gamer look when it's fully decked out with its additional cushions. 
There are a pair of cutouts near the top of the backrest, which not only add to that gamer vibe, but provide a way for the lumbar support cushion to attach to the chair with a pair of elastic straps. The armrests are the same 4D design as on the Master Series with all of the same adjustability and the same soft arm pads on the top. The similarities continue beneath the seat base as well, where you'll again get an aluminium five spoke base and 60mm XLPU casters. The overall feel of the Elite Series is similar to that of the Master. The cushioning is the same, but the seat can be made to feel a bit softer with those additional cushions. And while the seat cushion is very slightly slimmer overall, the inner section is the same width. The Elite pricing wise is slightly more affordable than the Master as well, starting at £340 for the standard version and coming in at £390 for the bigger Max model when they're at their full recommended retail price. So if you're on the taller and slimmer side of things and looking for something that's again versatile, this might be the model that you want to have a look at. And finally, we have the Ninja Pro, the out and out gaming chair from the Bully's gaming chair range. The Ninja Pro takes heavy inspiration from racing car seat design. It's got a curvy contoured backrest shape, which wraps around your sides and tries to keep you sitting central and up straight. Something which can be an issue if you've ever got sucked into a game and found yourself questioning your life choices at 3 a.m. You might end up knackered the day after, but at least your back won't be trying to take you down. There's only one size available this time around with the Ninja Pro, and there's only one finish as well, Ultraflex PU, which that does make the pricing a lot simpler. It's 320 quid when at full price. As I mentioned earlier, Boolies very often have some sort of discounting going on. Colours available are the white that I've got here for this video, this showcase, and then you can get a black, a teal, and a red model. Cushioning on the Ninja Pro is softer than any other of the gaming chairs from Boolies, and you can feel it when you sit down. This chair has been designed from the ground up to keep you comfortable over longer gaming sessions. Features like that cushioning, especially along the edge of the seat cushion itself, provide a really soft sitting experience. The backrest is taller and wider on the Ninja Pro than either of the other chairs we've looked at in this video, including the Max versions of both of them. It's a big, soft chair that doesn't shy away from its gaming-focused design. It comes with the same detachable lumbar and neck support pillows as the Elite chair, and which on top of the already squishy and soft padding makes for a much more sinky seat feel than anything else that Boolies offer. Standard seat adjustability is there to help you get comfortable. You've got seat height, tilt and recline, and they're all tweakable. And it's got the same 4D armrests found on all three models of the Boolies gaming chair. Now, Boolies engineers must be really happy with the current iteration of the five spoke base and caster setup they've got going on, as they're the same here as on the Master and the Elite series chairs. The same aluminium five spoke base, class four gas lift and 60 mil casters support the chair at the floor level. Overall, if you're a gamer who spends a lot of time at a desk or just someone who wants a bit more of a chilled out feel to their seat without the need of a fully adjustable lump support system, then this is the chair you'll want to look at. You'll want to give the Ninja Pro some consideration. So there we have it. That was the complete rundown of everything Bullies offer in their gaming series in 2024. Like I mentioned at the start of the video, I've reviewed all three of these chairs in detail in the past. So if you want a more in-depth look at a specific model, we'll leave links to those reviews in the description box below the video. If you go down into the comments, please let us and Bullies know what you think of these chairs and let us know what chair you're currently using in your setup as well. If you liked the video, don't forget to leave a like down below. I'd really appreciate it. And subscribe to Kit Guru to keep up with the latest PC gaming news and reviews. Anyway, guys, I've been Matt. This has been the showcase of all of the gaming chairs that Boolies offer in 2024. I will speak to you in the next one. Look after yourselves. See you later.